What's your favorite Drake song? Oh my god, my favorite song is Money to Blow. I got money to blow. I'm getting it in. We're on a champagne diet. While we sip it, we I encourage you to try it. Woo! I want to sit where you're sitting. <laughs> Party! Woo! We love you, Drake. All right, Mateo. What are your true feelings towards Drake? Uh, my true feelings towards Drake uh, is that he's a talented, scientific writer who, if he sits down, takes his time. Comes up with good lyrics, great lyrics, amazing songs, great features. But don't start shit with somebody you're gonna, you know, you're not gonna rebuttal to. You know, and who are you talking? You're talking about Common. About Common, the whole stay scheming scene, you know, comes out with the remix. Uh, doesn't even change your lyrics. Comes out with the remix. You don't respond. How long has it been? You started the whole thing. Just, just yeah. come at him. Just come back at it. You know. Hi, Caesar. And customer. Hi. How you doing? How long have you had this business here at the we've Verizon been, Amphitheater? We've been here for eight years. For eight uh, years? Yes. So do you serve the best taco in, in the house or what? We have the best Mexican food, yes. All right, cool. And you were telling me that your daughters are in there, right? Yes. Both of my daughters are enjoying the, the concert tonight. They're 18 and 16, you told That's me? Correct. But to you, every Drake song sounds the same. <laughs> you remember what I said. I huh? do remember what you said. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's, it's their favorite, but me, I, I don't know, I don't know the music. But you don't oppose his music? Oh, of course not, thanks. Okay, cool, we'll let him know. Alright, thanks. <laughs> thanks, Caesar. Alright, Bye. Okay, cool. So, do you have dreams of becoming a rapper like Drake? Yeah. And show me what you got then, let's see if you, you have what it takes. Uh, I may sip from a cup, but I still stay fucked up. I'm in the zone, but I'm hardly ever gone. My mind stay blown, but I stay off of that gone. Man, I'm hardly in the zone. I'm only a little kid, but you can see how I live. This is Cali, so I'm California dreaming while my headlights stay beaming. I stay scheming like I was French Montana. I rock like I was Santana, but I don't rock a bandana because I'm white, but better get it right. K-A-I, rep it to the end of life. Okay, okay, my man, all right. So tell, talk to me a little bit about um, your shirt and your hat. The shirt is YOLO, you only live once. Right, right. Drink. All the clothing yep. It's a good little saying, good little thing to live by. Right, right. Did you buy this shirt here or you came with it? I came with this. I bought the hat here. You bought the hat here? Yeah. How much was that hat? $40. Forty dollars? It's worth it. Damn, you are a Drake fan. First concert. I hear you got a little award. I got an award the other day. For being the biggest Drake fan ever known to mankind. Known to my, mankind. Yeah, don't blame me. I'll, I'll even show you. All right, I need, I need so to see. It's kind of hard to see, but like, okay, this award is awarded to uh, Brian Fields, uh -huh. the biggest Drake fan ever known to mankind. Known to mankind. <laughs> Who gave you this uh, purported award? My coworkers, because they know like, I'm a huge Drake fan. At work? Absolutely. Damn. So what? What qualifies as the biggest Drake fan ever? Like, what do you have to do? Everything I do is about Drake. Every, always, like, every time I go to work, all I do is bump Drake. Every time like, I listen to Drake, I know every word, every song. Okay. Um, I know every new song that comes out. All right, so I'm going to test you right now. I'm just going to I'm just gonna throw songs out there, and I want to hear like the four bars or something. All right, um, how about um, Hell Yeah, Fucking Right? I say, hell yeah, hell yeah, fucking right, damn right. Uh, That's the chorus. Everybody knows that. Okay. Uh, so much for being optimistic. Say love in the air, ain't no contradiction. 